long division with two digit divisors greater than 15. Why greater than 15? Simple. Till 15 you know the tables hence division is easy. But when you get a divisor that is greater than 15, all of you might not know the tables by heart. How to solve a sum when the divisor is a greater number is what we are going to see in this video. Let us take the example of 8697 divided by 15 first. You know the tables of 15 so long division is easy. Arrange. Start with 8. Not possible. 86 by 15. 15 will go 5 times. 15 fives are 75. Remainder is 11. Bring down 9. 15 will go 7 times at 119. 15 sevens are 105. The remainder is 14. Bring down 7. 15 will go 9 times in 147. 15 nines are 135 and the remainder is 12. Quotient is 579 and remainder is 12. This long division was easy since you already knew the tables of 15. But if we take the same dividend 8697 and change the divisor to 28. 28 is a large number and you do not know the tables. You might require to do a little bit of calculations. For that you need a rough column. I'll draw the rough column first. Coming back to the division 8 is not cannot be divided by 28. So we take 8 and 6 together, 86 by 28. To know how many times 28 will go in 86, I will write that in the rough column. 86 divided by 28. Looks a little difficult, isn't it? I'll share a simple trick with you which will make it easy. You know rounding off to the nearest tens, we'll round off the numbers. 86 will be rounded off to 90 and 28 will be rounded off to 30. Now can you divide 90 by 30? That's easy. Just cancel the zeros and divide 9 by 3 which is equal to 3. This means 28 will go 3 times in 86. But we can't write that answer as the answer. We have to cross check. We'll divide 28 into 3. 3 eighths are 24. Carry over 2. 3 twos are 6 plus 2. 8. 84 is less than 86. But to be sure, we will check 28 into 4 also. 4 eighths are 32. Carry over 3. 4 twos are 8 plus 3. 112. No. 112 is greater than 86. So it is 28 into 3. Write 3 as the quotient, 28 3 is 84 and when you subtract the remainder is 2 and you bring down 9. Now divide 29 by 28. That is easy. You know 28 will go only once in 29. Write 1 and 28 once are 28. When you subtract the remainder is 1, bring down 7 and divide 17 by 28 which is not possible because 17 is lesser than 28 so in the quotient you put 0 and 17 becomes the remainder that's the quotient 310 and remainder 17 let's do another example 6529 divided by 19 19 is greater than 15. You might not know the tables. So we'll draw the rough column first. Then arrange the dividend and divisor. Start with 6. Not possible. So we take 6 and 5. 65 divided by 19. To know how many times 19 will go in 65, we write 65 divided by 19 in the rough column. And now you know what to do. Yes, round off 65 to 70 and 19 is closer to 20. So 19 will be rounded off to 20. 
70 divided by 20 all you have to do is cancel the zeros and 2 will go 3 times in 7 which means 19 will go 3 times in 65. To cross check we will write 19 into 3, 3 nines are 27, carry over 2, 3 ones are 3 plus 2, 57, it is less than 65. We will check 19 into 4 also, 4 nines are 36, carry over 3, 4 ones are 4 plus 3, 76, 76 is more than 65, so it is not 19 into 4, it is 19 into 3. Write 3, 19 threes are 57 and when you subtract the remainder is 8 and bring down 2. Next you have to divide 82 by 19. We will write that in the rough column 82 divided by 19. 19 is rounded off to 20 and 82 is closer to 80. So, 82 will be rounded off to 80. Put the division sign and cancel the zeros. 8 divided by 2 is equal to 4. Now, 19 into 4 we have already done. So, we know it is 76 which is less than 82. But we will check 19 into 5. So write that 19 into 5, 5 nines are 45, carry over 4, 5 ones are 5 plus 4 is 9. No, it is not 19 into 5, 95 is more than 82. It is 19 into 4. So we wrote that 4 in the quotient and 19 fourths are 76. When you subtract, the remainder is 6 and bring down 9. Next, divide 69 by 19. Write that in the rough column, 69 divided by 19 and round off 19 to 20, 69 is closer to 70, so round off 69 to 70 and when you cancel the zeros, 2 will go 3 times. That we have already done, 19 threes are 57 and 19 fours are 76. So. 76 is more than 69, so it is not 19 fours are, it is 19 threes are. And 19 threes are 57. And when you subtract, the remainder is 12. There are no more digits left to divide, so we have got our answer. Quotient is 343 and remainder is 12. Let us do one more example. 76,593 divided by 34. Here the dividend and divisor both are large numbers. So we will definitely need the rough column. Draw that and then arrange the dividend and divisor. Start with 7. 7 is less than 34. So we take 7 and 6 together. 76 divided by 34. Write that in the rough column. 76 by 34. You know the procedure now. Round off 76 to 80 because it is closer to 80 and 34 is closer to 30. So 34 will be rounded down to 30. Put the division sign, cancel the zeros and 3 will go. 2 times in 8 which means 34 will go 2 times in 76. To cross check we will multiply 34 into 2. 2 4s are 8, 2 3s are 6, 68 which is less than 76. We will check 34 into 3 also. 3 4s are 12 carry over 1. 3 3s are 9 plus 1 10, 102. No, it is more than 76. So, it is 34 into 2 is equal to 68. Write 2 as the quotient and 34 twos are 68. And when you subtract, the remainder is 8. Bring down 5. Now divide 85 by 34. Write 85 divided by 34 in the rough column. Now here we can be smart. We have already done 34 into 2 is equal to 68. See, we have done that. 68 is 
less than 85 and 34 into 3 is 102 which is more than 85. So it will not be 34 into 3, it will be 34 into 2. 2 will be the quotient. So write 2 as the quotient and 34 2 is 68. Write that below 85 and subtract. The remainder is 17 and bring down 9. Now divide 179 by 34. Write 179 divided by 34 in the rough column. Here we have to round off. We do not have any other option. 34 is rounded off to 30. And 179 rounded off to the nearest tens will be 180. Put the division sign, cancel the zeros. And 18 divided by 3 is 6. Multiply 34 into 6 and see what the answer is. 6 4s are 24, carry over 2. 6 3s are 18. Plus 2 is 20. No, it is not 30, 34 into 6 because 204 is more than 179. So, we will try 34 into 5. 5 4s are 20. Carry over 2. 5 3s are 15 plus 2, 170. Yes, it is 34 into 5. So, write 5 as the quotient and 34 5s are <coughs> 170. When you subtract the remainder is 9. And bring down 3. Next, divide 93 by 34. Write 93 divided by 34 in the rough column. Now again, 93 divided by 34. We will not have to round off because we know 34 into 2 is equal to 68. Which is less than 93. And 34 into 3 is equal to 102 which is more than 93. So, it is not 34 into 3, it is 34 into 2, which will be the, the answer. So, once again, write 2 in the quotient and 34 twos are 68, write that below 93 and when you subtract, you get the remainder is equal to 25. The quotient is 2252 and remainder is 25. Hope it is clear to everyone.